Hello guys, Softoni here, welcome to another video tutorial, first like always, I want to thank you for watching this video lesson uh, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit that subscribe button and also turn on the bell icon so you can always get notified whenever I post a new clip. In this tutorial we're going to create this cool and creative liquid transition so without any further ado let's see what we will do today. Alright, we're back here in After Effects and our first step is to create uh, a new composition. Hit on this little icon or Ctrl plus N on your keyboard. We will do 9020 by 1080 duration 5 seconds long. And for this composition name we will uh, call it Transition. Hit OK and our next step is to create uh, our waves. So go here uh, or hit Q. Uh, on your keyboard go here to grab this rectangle tool make sure that uh, your fill co color is set to white stroke to none and just double click here on this icon and as you can see we have already created this uh, shape layer 01 and hit enter on your keyboard and we will rename it to wave 01 like so okay our first effect that we're going to use is turbulent displace drag and drop onto our wave 01 layer and it's time to make a few adjustments here for amount set to around uh, 200 and to size go to around 50 for displacement go to uh, twist and it's time to animate our waves go to around two seconds hit p uh, for position or go here to find here in transform for position here is our position, I will hit P, uh, set our first keyframe to maybe here around 2 seconds, go to around 0 frames and move this uh, X parameter to the left like so. Now when we hit 0, we have animation like so. Alright, next thing what we're gonna do is to animate our evolution, hit ALT on your keyboard and then left mouse on, uh, left click on our mouse and type, uh, type time asterisk uh, 150 like so now when we hit zero we have this really cool animation also grab those two keyframes hit f9 and then hit zero to see our animation okay our next effects is going to be ramp effect go to effects and preset and type ramp also if you can't find this effects and preset go to window and then uh, hit here to uh, show uh, this effects and preset also shortcut control plus five grab this ramp effect and move it and move it to our wave of one layer like so and we will do a few adjustments here for this uh, start of ramp go to around here and for the end of ramp maybe to around here like so also you can readjust according your needs and for the first color it will be dark blue and for the second one it will be light blue for now okay our next step is to duplicate our wave 01 hit ctrl plus d on your keyboard or go to edit and then duplicate move this uh, wave 02 to around uh, second frame like so and it's time to readjust our colors i hit this uh, wave 02 and then swap our colors also you can change colors according your needs but I'm just choosing random colors just to show you this technique and now when we hit zero we have something like this okay uh, also we will duplicate once again control plus D move the third layer uh, to around four frames uh, and we will also change our colors for the second one also we will swap it and then readjust it for this start color maybe to around so like so hit ok and we will also duplicate once again move uh, move this fourth layer to around six frames swap our colors and maybe darker this color like so as i already said you will uh, play around with those colors hit ok and now when we hit zero we have an animation like so 
All right, uh, our next step is going to uh, be to import our media here in our timeline. As you can see, I have already my media uh, folder here. And if you want to import your media, just go file and then import and then choose a specific file from your PC. OK, I will just drag and drop my media 01 here in our finals. And also I will du duplicate once again this wave 04 move it to around here and then just rename it hit enter on your keyboard matte like so okay and go to media 01 click here and if you can find this track mats hit to uh, this uh, expand or collapse a little icon here and just go alpha mat now when we hit zero we have this really cool animation okay I have already imported my video here, but also if you have an uh, image, you can uh, scale it a bit to, uh, ma to make a movement here. Hit S on your keyboard for uh, media 01, go to 120, set up our first, frame, uh, first keyframe like so, go to around maybe 3 seconds and set second keyframe to 100. Now when we hit 0, we have this really cool and awesome animation. All right, guys, uh, that was really easy tutorial. Uh, this was a really cool technique, so you can play around and use it in your photos, in your uh, videos, intros, slideshow, YouTubes, and so many more. Hope you like this video. If you like uh, this one, hit that like button, also subscribe, also comment and take a look on my profile on my channel for even more great tutorials until next time stay creative and bye bye